Hey planner babes, it's Amber from Amber Fancer Day. Just want to come on and do the rest of my Patreon patron spreads for the month of October. So make sure you stay tuned. All right, so today we have four more spreads to make and one of these spreads is going to be given away. So make sure you stay tuned for all those details because if you want to win never before seen Amber Plants Her Day stickers, then you definitely want to stay tuned. Okay, so let's start with this. Okay, so Shakira, she was like, you know what? I do not need a spread this week. How about we give it away? So Shakira is giving away her spread. So you guys will be able to see me make the spread and then we will do a comment in the comment video or the comments of this video if you guys want to win the spread. And the um, it will only be open today, Saturday, October 16th. And um, I'll pick a winner um, later on that evening around 10 o'clock. So you just have all day to comment and to win the spread that I make for Shakira for one of you guys. Then we have Beth who wants a currently page. So we're going to do some rustic fall currently page. Then we have, um, Patricia who wants a November monthly and big sized and farmhouse. And then we have um, Lisa, who wants an undated monthly with neutral fall brush strokes. She is obsessed with these, and so am I, Lisa. But she asked for plaid pumpkins, so I made my own plaid pumpkins. And these will also be available in my November release. So definitely, this is going to be like, this is going to be a great combo. But if you guys want this, then you're going to have to wait till November. All right. So we're going to get started with the giveaway spread first. And we're going to do it for November 15th through the 21st. And um, you guys can redate this if you want to. If you win, you can redate it, of course. But um, I just think... These are going to be so gorgeous, like a rust color with some teal in it. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So definitely want to start that out in the corner. Look, oh wow. Wowzas. Okay. And then let's get, I'm thinking, a flat edged one up here at the top. Mm, let me get my uniball signo. Here it is. I want to color out this line. I love that Shakira did this. So and I just love that idea of being able to give this away to somebody. And I'll try to make it not super um, full in case people want to add their own things to it. Um, but should I go like this? I'm trying to think. I am going to be adding some wreaths as well. These will be sell sold together. I'm thinking of making boxes that match like this tealy color and that rusty brown and orangish color. I think those would be really pretty. Um, to add to this as well. All right. Just a little bit more. Okay. And then we're going to do this live life with Thanksgiving. Put that over here, I think. Okay. And then hearts full of thanks, it's like inside of this wreath. I think it's just so gorgeous. I kind of want to put it down here in the bottom 
I'm gonna white out this area. I'm gonna do this one too. So pretty. Okay, let's do some. I kind of think we might do um, black boxes. It'll match the colors of. Um, it'll match the colors of the quotes, and then just make the rest of it pop. So I'll probably try to do like. Um, I'm just gonna grab black boxes instead of neutral. I think. So I think we're gonna try to do at least one box a day. Reason is because I want to make sure that whoever does get the spread um, has plenty of space to write everything that they need. Um, and then we'll probably put more florals around and then um, checklists too. Because if you're getting a spread given away by Amber from Amber Plans Our Day, then you definitely get checklists. Like, sorry, not sorry, but checklists are kind of my signature thing. And I'm definitely going to be giving, putting checklists on here. And then I want some smaller sized ones. I think we're going to do one here let's do i think even one smaller the size layered right there and then maybe one more of this next big size here okay but like this is gorgeous. This is gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Okay, I feel like we want some checklists though from JoJo's checklist sticker book. Some black checklists. Okay. I might not do checklists every day because I know some people just don't, but I definitely want to put quite a few around. Probably add some colorful floral in this section. Let's do one here. Can't have a week without checklists, if you ask me anyway. I think we're gonna put one there and I think one on the top of Sunday too. Oh my gosh. This spread is so gorgeous. Um, okay, I think we're gonna do the empty wreath. And then I think we're also gonna do um, at least this bouquet. I think that bouquet would just look so pretty. Okay. see. I think that would look good there. I think that would look good. Okay, and then this other bouquet. We're going to do that one. I think maybe up here. And then we're going to add some more quotes. Let's put that upside down. Wow, this is so pretty. Okay. So very grateful, incredibly thankful, unbelievably blessed. That's like perfect. And then gratitude is the heart's memory. It's going to overlap this box just a little bit because we'll have plenty of space for, um, For your checklist. Oh my gosh. This spread is gorgeous. 
So I, yeah, I, I grabbed two of each in case I wanted it, but I honestly think like this is pretty good. And I do even still have one more, um, which I feel like would, would be actually really cute up here. I think we're going to put it up there. Okay. We just need to white out this space. So yeah, if, so, if somebody doesn't want to use this for November, then the November's already gone. And then they can use it for whatever. Oh my gosh. This is, it's like so streaky. But I feel like that might, this might be good. Okay, so we want it kind of as much on there as we can, but I do think cutting some of it off would be kind of cute and pretty, so let's do that. Okay. Okay. Oh my gosh. Wow. Okay, this spread is gorgeous. Like, this spread is gorgeous. My patrons, like like I said, they recommended this like different color palette for Thanksgiving, and this is this is phenomenal. Okay, so that is the giveaway spread. Let me show it again. So this is the giveaway spread. You guys can enter to win. Just comment, hey, I'd love this spread. Um, you know, whatever like that, and I will randomly select somebody from the comments. Um, just later tonight. Um, around like 10 o'clock on Saturday, um, October 16th, I will just let the winner know and then I'll ship it out to them and they can either use it for this week or redate it or do whatever they want. But wow, never before seen Amber Planter Day stickers that will be coming to the shop in November, but people will get it early. Okay, next we have, let's do our big monthly spread. Okay. Um, farmhouse. It's gonna be this spread. And then yesterday I realized it's easier to punch this first to kind of cover up, give it a nice fall divider. If you did not see yesterday's video, I did talk about where this paper is from, but I just bought it at Joanne. It is Park Lane brand. And um, it's amazing. I'll show you guys the actual um, cover of it in just a second. I bought neutral colored one. And then I also bought um, the seasonal pack, which I love, 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 love. Okay, so line up the punches that on there so then she could just punch it in and have it kind of a fallish divider and then here is the pack so I love it because it's eight and a half by eleven from Park Lane and so it just fits the um, divider perfectly and then I bought the seasonal one too so from Joanne a really really good deal okay so let's do a farmhouse spread for Patricia. Okay. I'm trying to think down here just because there's no, um, there's no dates down there. And then probably put some six smaller ones up in these areas. Um, just to kind of draw some of it up top too. And then I definitely want to see about matching the colors. Um, so that um, we can maybe have some blue in here. I'm not sure if there's tons of blue in this specific sticker book, but, um, so there is like some, but a little bit of a different shade. 
I may end up covering it. I don't know. We'll see, I guess. But I do think some of these layering this with some of that foil color, that would just like look really pretty. Make it pop some. Okay, let me cut this off. Okay. And then just some like little ones up here. So pretty. Okay. Let's keep looking. I definitely want to give her, oh, those florals. I didn't realize I didn't use those ones. I probably would have used those ones, but it's okay. Um, definitely want to use some of these. Collect beautiful moments. I feel like that is just so good for Thanksgiving month. Okay, but I do want to add some leaves onto the other side of that. Something like this. Have this kind of layer. Oh, that's pretty. Collect beautiful moments. Okay, and then let me get another one of those because I love that. Okay, plant smiles, grow laughter, harvest love. I love that one too. It's like a really pretty pink. We're going to put that over here. And then. I want to layer this. Oh, that's not bad. It's already would cover up a little bit more of it than it did, so that's good. I like that. Just draws a little bit of that green in there. Okay. Let's see what else. She wants rustic. Rustic and fall. She didn't say like anything that she needs throughout the actual month, so I may put some boxes just around. Um, let's see. I don't need an inspirational quote. I need coffee. True though. Today is a good day for a good day. I think we're gonna use this one. And because it's that same pink color, mostly that's why. We're gonna cover up the 20th, but I'll show you guys something in some of the 13th too. But I'll show you guys something that you can do if you end up doing something like that and you're like, oh, like I actually need something on the 20th. So we'll layer a box with it. Um, kind of thinking this light brown color. So then she gets still right. And that could be either on the 19th or the 20th. And then we'll even do one on the 13th up here. So then you still have like the color and like, I mean, it just looks really good, but then you also have some functionality into it. And then I think we'll add some more around. I'm trying to think like of things that she may have going on just because I know she's busy. She is busy 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 she's amazing I want the lighter color oh here it is here it is okay okay I feel like Mondays I don't know like the first day of the week like of school wise I feel like that's gonna be I don't know I don't know the 15th. Something's telling me there's something on the 15th. Um, I think we'll do one on the 30th. That's like right before December. So that is busy, busy times. Usually getting ready for the holidays and things of that nature. And then maybe, maybe just maybe she has something to prep for Thanksgiving. Hopefully these are kind of accurate. If not, hopefully she can work around them. I mean, there is still like some space around, but hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. So it is hard making spreads for other people that are not you. Like you just don't know what they have. You don't know what they're doing. Like, um, 
sometimes they'll give you some details, but sometimes you just don't know. So let's just get some motivational stuff around here. Ooh, I'm gonna put get it done over here. Let's do, uh, remember, no, nope, 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 nope. Um, your heart knows the way, I like that, that's really pretty. I am gonna white out Hanukkah just because I already kind of covered it a little bit. Then I think we're just gonna put this. Your heart knows the way. Um, live more, worry less. I love this one. I think that would look actually really good right here. Ooh, look at that. The black is right in between all of those words. So that's good. <sighs> Some I don't know, you guys. What do I do about the top? I think what I'm gonna do is we're gonna take some sticker paper. I don't know, maybe I'll use some sticker paper. I might not do it now because I don't actually have any sticker paper on me um, and it'll probably take a little bit of time. But I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna take some white sticker paper, just cover it up. Should I do it? Should I do it, you guys? I guess we're just gonna do it. Okay, so I did it. I ended up just taking literally just any sticker paper. This is a sticker paper I use for my um, website, my sticker shop, amberplanterday.com, but um, you can use, I've used Avery labels in the past as well. And it is just amazing for covering things up and things like that. And I mean, seriously, I, I do not regret covering that up. So um, some things that we are gonna put up there though will be some leaves and some flowers to kind of, um, make it look a little bit better like some of these guys like maybe not like over the entire thing but over some of the area for sure well good thing I was gonna cut some off anyway because I ripped it ripped my finger okay and then something I'm going to do as well is I think we're going to use this one for this other set. I'm going to hand letter November and then 2021. So I don't want to take up too much. Okay. I kind of want to put the rest of that over here. Like that. Okay, so then we're gonna grab my, we're gonna grab the, my um, Pentel sign brush pen. And I love this for lettering on my planner. I love the Tombow Fenisuki as well, but we're just gonna letter. November, November, and then on this page it had 2021, so we're just going to do that, 2021. Okay, that's good. So now she'll still know the month that it's for since she asked for November. But I honestly think that that might be it because I really, now that like I tied it in up there, I love that. Let's just do some um, foil up there. I'll tie in some of that foil, kind of like layer some of that. Like that, ooh, that's pretty. And then um, put the rest of this one, maybe. I can get it to stay straight over here because this one has a 2021 so ooh that's pretty I just think we're gonna do the very small little um, piece over there too okay so that's what is done and this part is gorgeous. It's like very, like, I don't know, just very calming to me. 
So I love that. Okay, then now let's go and do, let's do our currently page. And then I need my paper in front of me because she asked for some very specific currently. So she asked for fall florals and rustic farmhouse. And I was like, what better than my neutral fall florals from Amber Panther Day with my rustic farmhouse stickers. This is going to be like a super cute combo here. Okay. I'm going to do this big. Uh, you know what? I'm actually going to do a few of these guys around the month of November. Okay. So we're going to start with a big one and then put one little one. And then I think on this side, just to make it a little bit different, we'll do the little one paired with, whoops with the big one. Oh, that's pretty. Then maybe put like a pumpkin up here. And then let's do, ooh, let's do this apple um, box up there. That's so cute. I love the apple box. And then um, I do want to give her some space in case she needs something to write. So I'm going to put this corner one here and then, oh, 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 hang on. Rocking chair. Oh yes. That rocking chair is so cute. And then let's do, let's do our currently stuff first before we move on anymore. I'm going to do neutral boxes and I don't know, should I do black boxes instead? No, I don't know. I think the brown would look okay. I think it is like just a little bit more golden-y, but like this color is not too far off. So I did already use so many of these. Um Wow, I've used so many of these. I think we're going to do black. We're just going to do black. Oh, these are my black quotes, which we're going to use as well. But we're going to do black boxes. Oh my gosh, you guys, this book is well loved. So she wants two, three... I did grab my currently page, my currently stickers. So she asked for going, let's see, buying, which I don't have one here, but I can write it, hand letter it for her. Um, watching we have, planning we have, loving, going I said, wanting, I don't have on here either. So we can definitely do all of those and I'll hand letter the two of them. And then releasing, she wants releasing too. And I don't have that either, but I think first things first, we are gonna put the currently actual sticker here. So then we can know this is her currently section. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we need seven. Some of them I think we're going to do smaller and then some of them this bigger size, these size right here. One, two, three, four, five, let's do two of these smaller ones. Whoops, that one got ripped. Six, one up here, seven. 
Okay. Now let's do the ones that I can do and then we'll letter the rest. So we have planning. We're going to just, just lay them out. Planning, buying, I don't have, we do need going. Um, what else do we need? Wanting, watching, watching we can do. I want to make sure that my hand, like my sticker ones and my hand letter ones aren't like right next to each other. So maybe I'll hand letter first. Um, I think for this spread, we're going to hand letter with a Tombow and a Suke. We're going to do releasing. I think we're going to do releasing right here. Re leasing. Leasing. Okay. Oh my goodness. I misspelled it. Relaxing. <sighs> Amber. Oh my gosh. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. I don't wanna use white out because I don't like hand lettering on top of white out. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna put a banner on top. We're just going to make this box a little bit bigger. We're going to hand letter releasing in the box. Okay, let's see if we can spell it right this time. Well, I can spell it right. R L E A S I N G. Did I spell it right? Please let me have spelled it right. Okay, so then releasing and then buying, I don't have. We have watching, so I'm gonna do watching. Let's put watching right here. Loving, I do have that one. Loving, going, wanting, and planning. So I need wanting. I think I might put wanting up here. Loving, but I feel like she needs a bigger box for wanting. Okay, so what was the other words I needed? Buying, buying and wanting, okay. So maybe what she's wanting is more than what she's buying, hopefully. Or maybe what she's buying is um, more than what she's wanting, <laughs> which sometimes happens, okay? So it's gonna be okay. Buying, okay. Okay, that's cute, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Perfect. And then let's add a black quote. From um, Amber Today. I do still have some of these in stock. So you might want to get it because this is adorable. I kind of wonder if I could put pumpkin everything up here. Oh, that's cute. <gasps> that's cute. Let's do another one. It's like November. So I want it to not be like. I don't know if like Hello Fall would really go super good. Um, then we will do Autumn Leaves and Pumpkins, please. I'll do that over here. Okay. Then we're gonna do these pumpkins here. Oh my goodness, with this super cute watering can. This watering can is adorable. Um, and then I'm gonna leave this just in case she needs to write anything else down. But then I think that's it. I think that's everything. Everything that she asked for specifically. I love those neutral fall florals with the rustic, um, 
with the rustic decor. That's cute. Okay, we have one more spread, you guys. And then we're going to be done. So, um, Lisa asked for a big undated, and that's what we're going to give her. She asked for plaid, but I can't blame her because I love plaid. I love seasonal plaid. I think that that is just so pretty. All right, so I did, I'm gonna use the um, undated extension pack that just released with the fall release. You got, I did end up just um, finding some downloadables on Etsy, which I think will be awesome because I don't have to worry about covering all this stuff up. But I'm really excited to cover it up this month because we're gonna be using the fall brush strokes. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. And I think that it'll look so pretty covering this stuff up. Okay, we're gonna have to punch, punch that section. Okay, let's add. Ooh, let's do it on top like this. Okay, and then we'll cut this little bottom or the strip off. Ooh, I'm already loving this. Okay. Let's see here. I think maybe like this. This one doesn't actually need to cover up that hole, which is nice. We can just like put it over as far as we can and then kind of layer it down and then go with um Kind of like a nice neutral one with maybe, oh, oh, hang on. Let's do the pumpkins again. Okay, that's not big enough. Um, Hang on, hang on here. We're doing this one. I'm gonna do this one like this with that one. And then this one. Ooh, let's let's actually use partly of this guy. And then I kind of want to put the rest of that down there. Okay, now let's cut some off because we could even layer some of this. Let's see if these scissors work. Trish, I just made her spread um, earlier today, the other big one, and she um, actually sent me these scissors. She's amazing. And I love these scissors. Um, they're like precision scissors. They're just amazing. So let's see what we have. These two pieces are going to be trash. This one is also trash, but I think we are going to put... some more over here. I think maybe like this. Okay, so there's some brush strokes to cover that up. I'm gonna put a pumpkin down here, probably mix it with this brush stroke, just to make sure that this covers it. Um, I think we're gonna use this one. Quad pumpkins, yes, please. Okay. I actually think I'm gonna put the rest of this one up here too, just so that it kind of fills up that space a little bit. Cute. 
Oh, I love the brush strokes, but we definitely need more brush strokes. I think I'm doing more brush strokes next month for like next month's release. So we're just going to put these around. So they're so nice as like little washi strips, as um, just little added decorative stickers. Okay, maybe one, two with pumpkin. Let's do some, um, let's do this pumpkin set over here. I just like love the way that it layers with things. This one definitely wants a pumpkin too. I think first, things first, we're going to layer with one of those. Do a plaid pumpkin. She had, didn't tell me anything like specifically date wise. So I'll probably leave most of it um, with space to write. Um, and then kind of go from there. Try to give her, probably add a few boxes here and there, but um, maybe not a ton of boxes. I think we're gonna do this one up here with that one. Oh my gosh, I'm loving the spread. These pumpkins are just amazing. But you know what? We should probably put some pumpkins up here too. Like, I would think just to kind of combine. I did print off a second pumpkin sheet because I was like, we might want a lot of pumpkins. This is a big spread. So sometimes when it's a bigger spread, we like to have more stickers um, just to kind of fill up the space. Um, I'm kind of thinking something like this one up here. Oh, I love this. With the brush strokes. And then I'm thinking um, maybe like two of these over here. Oh, so cute. Oh, I might layer actually this plaid pumpkin with it. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. This is so good. This is so good. Okay, we, I'm, I'm committing to at least one more pumpkin. Um, to at least one more. And I think we're gonna layer it with this one. Mm. My gut's kind of telling me up here. What do we think, what do we think? I feel like it's decently, oh, maybe I can layer it here. Ooh, let's do that. So let's go like this. Okay, once once I saw that, I instantly knew that's where it needed to be, and I love it. Okay, so I do think I want to add, well, some black quotes from Amber Panther Day. Let's go to the fall ones at least. Um, the whole world changes color. I think that's super pretty. Okay. Fall vibes. Ooh, that would be really cute right here. I think I'm going to color this one out. Fall vibes. Um, Pumpkin kisses, harvest wishes because pumpkins, because this is like a pumpkin brush stroke plaid. Gorgeousness, gorgeousness, you guys, this is gorgeous. Okay, then let's just see, oh my goodness, I cannot wait for my next quotes book. It's gonna be so good. Making things like, making things, oh, it's just, when you make things and you submit things and then it's like, it's just in the waiting process. Oh, we're going to do this. Everything happens for a reason. 
I think that'll be a good one. And then just a girl with goals because Lisa has goals. Lisa did just start a YouTube channel too. So I'll um, link that down below in case you guys want to support her. She's, she's doing it. She's doing the thing. Everything happens for a reason. And just a girl with goals. Okay. I don't want to put boxes in here. Lisa, tell me what you think. Should we put boxes in here? Or I know you have some of JoJo's stickers. I'm thinking you should put boxes where you need them. But we have so much space to do it. There's like so much space to do boxes wherever you need. And I'll, um, you know, just make sure that there's plenty of plenty of space. Do you need a punch? I think we're going to punch it on the bottom because then we can line it up exactly with the punch. It did not line up exactly, but actually it didn't do too bad. It didn't do awful. But what I think I'm going to do is just cut some of that out just in case just in case something goes wrong and this kind of got a little bit messed up too Oop. okay and then this didn't cut doo, 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 doo. there we go okay just all right i am in love with this spread. I think I'm going to pull this bottom part off though. Okay. Oh my goodness. This is so good. Okay. You guys, we did it. So we have these pumpkins will be releasing in November. Lisa got them early. We have rustic fall currently page with some fall florals. We have our big farmhouse spread. And don't forget, we have our giveaway spread. So this giveaway spread will um, be available for giveaway today only, Saturday, October 16th. And it'll just be all day. So later this evening around 10 o'clock, I'll just pick a random winner and I will get it sent out to them so that they can um, plan with this. They can redate it. They can use it whenever they want. So so good. Oh my goodness. So many good spreads today. I'm so in love. Okay. Thank you guys so much for following along as I plan all of my Patreon BFF spreads for the month of October. I hope you guys will continue to follow along as I plan my life day to day. Continue to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel.